Dad's school was closed too, so he took me and Jamie sledding down Skeleton Hill in the park. On the way home, I spotted this banged up wooden sled kind of propped up against the old Indian rock monument. Dad said to leave it, it was garbage, but something told me it would make the greatest sled ever. So Dad let me drag it home and I spent the rest of the day fixing it up. I super glued the broken slats together and wrapped some heavy duty white duct tape around them for extra strength. Then I spray painted the whole thing white with the paint I had gotten for the alabaster sphinx I was making for the Egyptian Museum project. When it was all dry, I painted lightning and gold letters on the middle piece of wood and I made a little lightning bolt symbol above the letters. Dad was like, wow, Jackie, you were right about the sled. The next day we went back to Skeleton Hill with lightning. It was the fastest thing I've ever ridden. So, so, so much faster than the plastic sleds we'd been using. And because it had gotten warmer outside, the snow had become crunchier and wetter. Good packing snow. We were in the park until our fingers were frozen and our lips had turned blue. Dad practically had to drag us home. By the end of the weekend, the snow had started turning gray and yellow, and then a rainstorm turned most of the snow to slush. When we got back to school on Monday, there was no snow left. It was rainy and yucky the first day back from vacation, a slushy day. That's what I was feeling inside too.